Hi there everyone, welcome back to the channel. So it's been a while since I did an Area 51 video, so as such I have one for you all today. I would love to be doing more of these kind of secret unknown Area 51 videos, however it's honestly pretty hard to find content to report on that hasn't been seen before regarding this subject, but I think you all will find this one pretty interesting. Enjoy. So what I'll be showcasing today is a YouTube channel known as NASA Gym 108, which hasn't had any activity for over six months. The channel contains videos from which only can assume is from Jim, leaking information regarding Area 51 and life on Mars. Claiming as such, he's an old former NASA employee. His voice is distorted and no personal content is linked onto the channel itself. It's very interesting to hear what this person has to say when it comes to this. However, there is still a little bit of doubt on the authenticity of this. You may choose to believe in what you may, but keep in mind this could very much be the truth. And if it is, then what you're about to see is never before and see footage regarding life outside of this planet. Uh, a sound clip that I have. Uh, this is a sound clip of a... Uh gray alien uh, directly after uh, what we called a transmutation. This is where he shifted into a sound frequency. Um, I'm going to play this for you and uh, it's important to understand that uh, these, these, these beings, they are uh, they, they can exist inside of you in the form of thought forms, in the form of negative thought forms, and uh, they reproduce themselves via language and your the things you say throughout the day. Now I know that's very difficult for some of you to grasp. I'm, it was one of the most difficult things for me to understand. It's we've been so conditioned to think that aliens are. are green creatures that come down in ships and start blasting us, but uh, the reality is far more sinister and horrifying than that. These beings exist within our very language, our very thoughts, our very thought patterns. I'm gonna, I will leave you in now and I will end this video. Uh, following is uh, the sound of a gray alien uh, directly after transmutation. My name is Jim. I was an aeronautic research engineer at NASA from 1989 to 2004. I was recently diagnosed with bone cancer and told that I have five months left to live, approximately. I don't want to die with the weight of having concealed information from my human brothers and sisters on my mind, so I'm going to tell you what I know and show you some images and some video that will, if nothing else, help you understand the width and breadth of uh, an incredible conspiracy that has been going on for a lot longer than the United States. Uh, the Illuminati, for lack of a better word, consists of a group of people who have suppressed uh, humanity and have convinced people to be slaves without them even being aware of it. How does this connect to Mars? Well, as it turns out, there's a subterranean species that lives on Mars of very highly advanced intelligence, and uh, they've been in communication with world leaders for some time. Uh, people call the little guys the Greys. When I was working at NASA, I saw one of them. Um, the descriptions everyone's made of them uh, is accurate. The big black eyes, the nose, and uh, well, they're, let's just say they're not the most pleasant creatures to be around. They're fully telepathic. They can read your thoughts and they can implant thoughts into your mind. And they are 
mischievous in a kind of robotic way. They don't have the same kind of human empathy that we're accustomed to, and they really don't feel that it's wrong to kill as they consider the great universal intelligence that fills up all of us to be the true life and our human bodies to be kind of like balloons. And for them, killing is just like popping a balloon. I saw them uh, in a laboratory kill a scientist with thoughts and uh, just drop dead and the thing seemed pleased. Nobody could really do anything about it because we're in the process of uh, sharing technology with these creatures. Though we do admonish them for things like that, they certainly don't do anything to punish them. The photo you're seeing right now is a photo of Sedona on Mars. Uh, this photo has been completely photoshopped. If you saw the real photo, now I'm just putting in an overlay here so you can get an idea, you would see a uh, some ancient ruins from the a civilization that used to exist on Mars but was wiped out by its own technology. <laughs> This is just going to be the first of many posts. Uh, I really don't have the strength to spend much more time doing these things. Uh, check back and, and uh, I'll post some more. What you are watching right now is created by a scientist by the name of Bill Schmidt, who worked very closely with the Greys. This device is seeding your subconscious mind so that tonight you will have a very specific dream. I will not go into the details of this dream so that you do not think you have fallen prey to hypnosis or suggestion. This will work regardless of your belief in aliens, interdimensional beings, extraterrestrials, or anything of that nature. I suggest that you only watch this once every 24 hours. After I learned that there were many other people like me out there, people who had worked at different government facilities but were now suffering from a variety of ailments, cancers, tumors, diseases, all of them fatal, then I began to realize that dissent in these organizations meant death. I began to make contact with scientists and government workers who were suffering from ailments similar to mine and I began to record their stories. Many of them had gone half insane from what they had learned, but one of them, a man by the name If you wish to research some more for yourself, then I'll leave some sources in the description below. I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, then don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this every day and week. Take care, and I'll talk to you in the next video.